Edo State Government under Monday Okwegolo administration don't talk say Edo State Internal Revenue Service now the only body where they license to collect revenue money for the state. Secretary to the State Government Barrister Uma Musa Ihilo Esquire talk this one on behalf of the state government for one total session with Tori people where them do for government house on Monday, November 18, 2024. Them to talk session gather important people like State Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice Dr. Samson Osaige, Chief of Staff to Edo State Governor Gani Audu, Chief Press Secretary Fred Itwa, Secretary of Edo State Internal Revenue Service Sadat Abu, plus Tory people and other government officials. The purpose of the meeting now to explain why revenue collection stalled for the state since Wednesday, November 13, 2024. For his statement, Barrister Musa Ehilo Konya and the public say may they report anybody where no get license, but still they collect revenue for government. It come also answer a question from Tory people where asked about the agency where they're responsible for revenue collection for the state. The attention of the state government has been drawn to the continuous collection of revenue across the state by unlicensed agents and towns who do not have the authority of government to do so. While the suspension of all non-commissioned officials in the collection of revenue remains in place, henceforth, only statutory and licensed revenue collectors are mandated to operate and collect revenue on behalf of government, especially in motor parks and other spheres of commercial activities. The public is hereby notified to report any unlicensed agents to the police, as government will not hesitate to arrest and prosecute those found wanting in this regard. These agents, their sponsors, are warned not to test the iron will of this government and its determination to secure the lives and property of the good people of Federal State. They are the recognized party and local party. However, sometimes they license some agents to collect revenue. And um, the, the, the process is open, you know, to, to application and all that. So we thought that what we recognize is Edo Revenue Service and anyone approved by Edo Revenue Service, anyone operating on outside this ambit is an illegal um, collector of uh, revenue. And that is why we say we should be vigilant, you know, ask questions and, uh, you know, report any of such unlicensed persons to uh, the police and um, His Excellency the Executive Governor has briefed, uh, has collected brief from security uh, agencies and the police to be very much aware because we see clearly how this is tied to security uh, challenges and tension and so all security agents operating within the states have been briefed on this matter and uh, they are very much on top of the game to arrest such uh, unauthorized collectors. Dr. Samsi Osage will be the state attorney general and commissioner for justice. Come also took mat for the matter. As him here and say revenue collection a matter of law, not be politics. He cost the talk, say the governor, Senator Monday, Okwegolo, they serious to follow the law, and anybody will break the law will face the full punishment. It needs to be emphasized that revenue collection is a matter of law. It's not a matter of politics. And this governor, Senator Monday Upewo, is committed to following the law in whatever uh, he has set out to do in realizing his vision for Edo State. And that was why when that statement was issued, it was in recognition of the fact that uh, there are illegal revenue collections who go about harassing the people of Edo State. And he promised that he was going to defend their rights, ensure that those type of harassment does not occur. So to that extent, the point being made today is that if you are not licensed by the only legally statutory body in a do state to collect revenue, and that is the do state internal revenue service for emphasis, you have no business jumping on the street 
to collect revenue. If you do so, the point is that you will be committing illegality, be committing a crime for which the security agencies can arrest you and prosecute you for. So the point is, let's have a law-abiding society. This government is committed to having a society that is governed by law, not by the whims and caprices of individuals. Because this government is committed to working for Edo people within the ambit of the law. So I think that point needs to be made very clear. Sadat Abu, Secretary for Edo State Internal Revenue Service, for her part, can talk say anybody will want to register with the agency if do so now. Like this, I can said, you the press statement made before a kind of um, drop some controversy of who should be the actual person to collect revenue. Those who were not licensed just took to, went to the field and started chasing people who were licensed out of the field for them to start to collect. The process of um, engaging people to collect revenue is open to anybody who wants to do that. You apply, you meet the conditions, we engage you by issuing you a letter of engagement, which is renewable. It's not a permanent thing. You meet from time to time, on a yearly basis, some six months. So, as it is now, anybody who wants to apply for that exercise and apply to internal revenue will look at the, the person's um, resume, if you can call it this, yes, we engage you. Make on another forget say, as we see them, now so we they talk them. We know they take blame. From Government House Benin City, Ekata Ojisoli, TMC.